It's a big one. Oh, you see it? <laughs> oh, that's a beautiful fish. Oh, beautiful brown trout. Oh, and I, oh, good. He got away without breaking it. <laughs> oh, I thought I saw the line move a little. I pulled it in and then the line really moved. And I'm amazed that they haven't broken the fly off it. That was a nice trout. Thank you, Lord. And I've seen over on this side end of the log, I've seen trout a couple times like shining and, and diving down. So I'm going to try casting over here now. The rainbow there. It's, it might have been the one who's been coming up numerous times and hasn't taken it. Oh. I saw him come up and grab it. The line moved. Let's see if I can keep getting him. They don't seem as brilliant as all these mystical trout articles seem to talk about. If anything, the smallmouth seem more brilliant. I caught a bluegill, too. I think I've caught one of these in the past. <laughs> the only big fish right now that I see swimming around is this, I think it's a red fin chub. I think that's, I'm pretty sure it's not a carp. There's a nice smallmouth cruising through. Oh yeah, there's one of those chubs, ugly. That's not what I saw the other day. There is, is that the smallmouth? He's huge. Of course, he won't take the fly. I love standing here and just watching being here silent enough, not moving until they swim around. I wish that I could tell unequivocally that monster smallmouth. And it doesn't seem that there are trout in this part. I know I've Hooked them right over there, and I caught one a couple years ago over there. Just wish I could see a two foot trout here. one there. Oh, I lost him. <laughs> I got that rainbow. The line moved. It, I let it drift about a minute and a half down there. Oh, <laughs> rats. That's four trout, two caught, two missed. <laughs>